Hey, you guys, I have a confession to make. <laughs> I forgot Jason's birthday. absolutely horrible. It's actually not till tomorrow, so I technically haven't forgotten about it. So today, I was working in my study. The girls were all up on their calls, and Jason suddenly said that his dad was out, going to be out front. And it didn't seem out of the ordinary. And I saw Jason go out and say hi to his dad, but I heard his dad through the window say, hey, I just thought I'd bring a birthday gift and help celebrate the day. And I thought, well, whose birthday is he celebrating? And I went outside and I looked and his dad had gotten him a bag of s'mores. I don't even know, like Jason told him about it last week, I think when he came by that his he loves these s'mores. But as soon as I saw the bag of s'mores, I knew instantly I had forgotten Jason's birthday. He doesn't care. He just thinks it's funny that I forgot for the first time. And so we have been together now for so 19 years of marriage and four years of dating. So 23 years this is the first year that I have forgotten his birthday. Thank you, 2020. <laughs> he will hold this over my head for now until like we die because I just don't forget stuff like this and I feel horrible. So I'm at Target trying to find a few birthday presents. We don't have a huge budget and he doesn't like me to spend money on him anyway. So I'm just gonna go into Target and see if I can find something fun and I'll definitely get him his bottled root beer that I get him every year. It's the only time of year that he gets it for birthday and for Father's Day, I guess. And then I don't know what I'm gonna get him. He's like, there's, he even told me, he's like, there's no new movies that you can get me. And that's what he likes to do. He likes to watch his movies and there's nothing that is out in release because nothing is being made. And anyway, so I'm gonna go and try and find something. I also forgot my camera. So I'm doing this from my phone, which I hate doing. Wish me luck that I can find him something for his birthday. Clearly he got his snack, he got his s'more. So I'm not getting him any more of those. We already know my thoughts on that. And I don't even think he deserves some M&Ms. <laughs> because he's had so many s'mores. So let's just go see what we can do. He asked me what I wanted to do for a birthday dinner, going out on a date, what does he wanna do? And he says, I don't care if like the two of us go out on a date for my birthday and I don't care if the family wants to go out, but I want all of us to go out together if we go out that way. So that's tricky because we need to make sure we find a restaurant that everyone wants to go to and has either outdoor seating or, you know, that kind of thing. Ashley went around and asked everyone what they wanted to do and everyone said Burger Master, which I su was surprised because we haven't done Burger Master since like the beginning of quarantine, which is super fun because we can all be in our car and we don't have to, it's actually kind of chilly today so we don't have to be cold sitting outside. We don't have to wear a mask. We can just sit in our car and hang out. Just kind of have a fun birthday for Jason. So I'm going to run into Target really quick and see if I can find something. But I'll bring you along. What do you guys think Jason wants for his birthday? I wish I was more in advance to get help from you guys. But I am clearly like late to the game. So I didn't too, do too bad for forgetting and he doesn't understand that he doesn't like me to spend money on himself anyway, regardless of forgetting his birthday until the day before. <laughs> he just doesn't like me to. So I could show you what he's getting, but really like I'll probably have him open his presents tonight because he has to work tomorrow. A lot of this conversation came up because he kept asking me if it was okay if he worked tomorrow, which is his normal day off. And I kept saying, yeah, it's just frustrating that you have to switch. It's just annoying. And then he ended up taking today off, which was nice. And so I said, okay, it doesn't really matter. And he kept asking me, are you sure it's okay? Are you sure it's okay? And what he was saying was, are you sure it's okay that I have to work on my birthday? And I didn't catch the clue yesterday when he kept asking me that. So I, I just kind of feel bad, but I'm going to go home and wrap this stuff up and probably get ready to go out to Burger Master, ready to go out. I'm not going to change or do anything different because it's you're eating in your car. All right. So I have his birthday present all wrapped up. This is just the rest of the stuff I got at Target, but now I'm going to go in and get everyone ready to go celebrate his birthday. Happy birthday, babe. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got you the music off. 
I was glad that the, the restaurant that the girls picked was something that was okay with oh, you. No. <gasps> oh no, what My in the world? Be closed until further notice. Oh, Why just as I was saying, because well, didn't I didn't think. think. It must be remodeling or something. Wendy's. Chick fil A and Wendy's, it is, I guess. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't even know I didn't to even think look about at it. it. They've been busy every, I mean, this is like the place that could survive this pandemic. They were a drive through in the big, before all this started. Yeah. All right, well. Oh, well, there we go then, 2020. That's, that's just. It's, it all right, like Chick-fil-A saves the day <laughs> and, sorry, it's not focused. There's not any, well, there is a line, but we're not gonna be stuck on the road for very long. Which makes him happy. He can't stand, he's already stressed about it. No, I just. It's, you know, you're blocking traffic. Yeah, but this is like, everyone knows that this line blocks traffic. I mean, check this out. There's so many memes about like Chick-fil-A. If you can, everyone can just do things like Chick-fil-A does. There's one, two, three drive through lanes. And I wanna see how long it takes us to get out of here. It's six o'clock, we just barely pulled in. So, look, let's just see how efficient these guys can be. Behind the okay. red one, all right. Ordered by 6.06. Now we'll see how far we get in this line, or I guess how quick we get in this line. All right, 6.12. It's actually, it was 6.11. So 12 minutes to get our food through that line. Not too bad. Happy birthday. Yeah, happy birthday. It's really glamorous, isn't it? Yeah, it's fine, it's fun. We're actually gonna get a sunset tonight. Oh, Come down to our little birthday. favorite little water spot. Oh, no. All right, while well, the kids get out of the car, I have Chick-fil-A <laughs> sauce down on the floor. Ooh. Wonderful. Yeah, but seriously, look at that hill. view, man. That's a nice view for your birthday, right? <laughs> I mean, yes, it's, it's nice. A good it's a good view. It's a yeah. day. Oh, it wasn't recording. What? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I totally got it. Happy birthday. Wait, should dad open his presents really quick? All right, just know that I have the receipt if we need to take anything back. <laughs> That's what happens when you get it the day of. That's because that someone didn't respond to my text messages. <laughs> just take it all out. That one you don't have to take back. Oh, I like this. It's cool. I like every other. Yeah, every other shirt you have. <laughs> I actually wanted to get a different color. They just didn't have your size. That's good. I, I caved yes. to the M&M's. So we might need this one. We have this. We have, we have these others. I know. You didn't respond to your messages. <laughs> you knew what I was going to do. No, a half hour later you responded. It's about hearing the team. They're being... Anyway, <laughs> this one I think we need. So All right. Cool. Wait, which one is the one? Oh, yeah. Deathly Hollows. Oh. The last one. Do we watch that tonight? No, it's still a school night. So, so tomorrow we have You tomorrow. can take the mask off. No one's around. Thanks, love. Uh, okay. I've got to go so, to the bathroom. There you go. Okay, you're going to race the obstacle course, right? Yeah. Ready? Okay, hit and set, go! Go! Okay, 37.97. All right. Okay, go. Hurry! Oh, 
31. Way to go! Dad's turn. If he doesn't beat him, he must be a year older. Stop! I'm gonna beat you. I'm gonna beat you. How much is it? 26.10. She's scratching. <laughs> okay. Stop. No. Uh, I, so dad got 26.6. So 26 point, oh, what did no, I No, you got 26.1. I got 26.1. You got 26.6. You're a half six. second difference, Chelsea. Oh, that was awesome. And then I'm probably... So Abby didn't want to be filmed, but she got 22. 22. Oh, you destroyed me. You just well, got... Okay, I got to do it again. You got Abby. You got to go again. 20 seconds. Oh, yeah, you're a oh, 21. 22. 22. Oh. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh. 19. 19. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, okay, go, go Abby. Go, I got it. You don't know. So Jason's gonna turn the alarm on. <laughs> the girls are up there. <laughs> Well, happy birthday, Jace. So you have a good day. Fun. Thank you. I know it's tomorrow, but we have to celebrate yeah, it today. Okay. Yeah. Do we have fun? Yeah. The girls, the girls have won't fun? let us film them back there. Okay. So they're all turned away from us. But thanks for joining us today on his pre birthday, only birthday celebration that we have time to do. Yep. But glad we got to do it. It's fun. Okay. See you guys later.